Family, this is the last day of the K Love Cruise 2024, day four. If you have been enjoying the video so far, can you do me a favor and like, comment, and subscribe? Click on the notification bell to be informed of future posts. This morning, we start off once again with morning worship with Caleb and John and a word from Pastor R.T. Kendall. And then there's so much more on the agenda. Stay tuned. This is amazing grace. Yeah. This is amazing love. That you would take my place. That you would bear my cross. You chapter 4 verse 6 for I have already been poured out as a drink offering and the time of my departure is close I have fought the good fight I have finished the race I have kept the faith to quote C.T. Studd only one life will soon be passed only what's done for Christ will last well I would have thought that finishing well is arguably the greatest and the most noble ambition you could have in this world now did you finish well in 2023 do you feel that you did when this is the new year, we're still at the beginning of it. It's the last day of January. And finishing well uh, is a goal for this year. But most of all, when it comes time to die, because this life is not all there is, and every one of us will die, you will die alone. And the greatest goal I can imagine is to finish well. I would define it as having the assurance that you have pleased God. And nothing is better than that. Today they have baptisms for all that desire it, so I'm going to capture some of that as well. Awesome. If you've never been baptized or you just want to be baptized again, they offer it here on the last day of the K-Love Cruise. 2024 awesome experience to come here hear the music and just be renewed in your faith and be baptized either once or again so what's happening here today is people are making a proclamation of faith if you're here with a family or a loved one who's being baptized encourage them they need that encouragement they need that support amen uh let's welcome Deborah really quick here
what an awesome experience that was for the baptism service. People were crying, cheering. It was so moving. Stay tuned, so much more to come on this last day of the K-Love Cruise 2024. After the baptism, I went to go see Jared Emerson in the theater. He is a painter that paints with his fingers these phenomenal paintings. Let me show you it now. So let's just get into this first one and then we'll go from there. Y'all ready? Yeah. I said, are y'all ready? Yeah. All right. Hold on. Actually, you know what? I forgot to take the tops off the paints here. So, uh... Hopefully this works because when I came back here to prep all my stuff, I spilled one of these cans. Luckily, in my own stuff. Uh, so, I was scooping paint to put it back in earlier. So that was my morning. How was yours? <laughs> of kings and Lord of Lords. The Lion of Judah. And he's also a sacrificial lamb. So I'm going to do something similar to that for you guys today. So I hope you all enjoy it. Caleb and John is doing another concert on the Lido deck. Let's go.
Family, I'm getting ready to hear Cochran and Company. They were rained out on day two of the K Love Cruise 2024, and so now we get to hear a full set from them. Let's go. But thank God for Sunday morning. Thank God for Fam, tonight's concert will be the artist Mac Powell and Kane. Let's go. Family, one more concert left for the K Love Cruise 2024, the farewell concert on the Lido deck. Let's go. So, as you guys go home tomorrow, take all these memories with you, what God has done for you in your heart. Testify what God has done to people that may be in the grocery store, in the neighborhood, whatever it is. And we will continue to stay connected through positive, encouraging, and K Love.
Family, that is a wrap for the K-Love Cruise 2024. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Until next time, stay blessed.